digital transformation that is needed in the education sector is enormous. There's a huge challenge to climb and of course funding is both quite scarce and difficult to come by. So as we move forward, the opportunity that Cloud presents in this digital transformation space is actually huge. It means that universities don't have to invest in the same amounts of capital, they don't need to create their own server rooms, they can outsource more effectively by moving workloads to and from the cloud. Of course, the cloud creates its own different challenges and those challenges are about how do they keep their costs low, move only the workloads that they need to work to the cloud and keeping control over data security because for universities in the education sector, data compliancy and security for its students and its staff is paramount. Digital transformation to the education sector and all parts of that from higher education of schools to universities can at first seem very overwhelming. There's huge amounts of choice in the marketplace today and there's a lot of acronyms. IAS, PAS, SAS, nobody really understands what does that mean. So what's the opportunity that's out there today is huge and organisations like Kojiko P1 need to work hard to ensure that they can become a trusted partner through marketplaces like Cloud28 Plus and Hewlett Packard Enterprise to offer assured data solutions that you know are going to give control to the university and to the education sector so they're not giving up their accountability or their responsibility for infrastructure services but they're not necessarily having to do it themselves.